We embarked on this study with the hope of finding ways of serving patients in the surgical arena, uh, namely women with breast cancer, because research tells us that 50% of women with breast cancer experience significant anxiety. And some of the women choose amazing grace, and other women choose I'm walking on sunshine, whoa. And it's really wonderful because we get to use the music that speaks most to them. Some of these women are in a place where they're reverent, they're feeling down, and they want to be met exactly where they are. Other women are celebratory. They are curing their cancer, and they want to celebrate. And the great thing about music is that we can meet them exactly where they are. Now during the surgeries, it's all the same music, only because the length of surgeries are, are different. So we use just relaxing music, and we try to use music that um, has no associations. So it's music by a composer that um, they would not know. So that's just the background, relaxing music. These women have said that in a place where everything is a mystery and a question mark, this gave me the control gave me the power. And, and beyond just the feelings of control, we know that music, it stimulates the release of endorphins in the body. It can re reduce blood pressure and heart rate. It can boost the immune system. And when all of this happens, anxiety can't coexist in the body. So she asked me what song I wanted. I chose Sarah McLachlan's Angel. And so she sang that a cappella with her guitar in the little surgery room with the curtain pulled. It was the most beautiful thing. And they took my blood pressure before and after. And it was, it was a marked difference in my blood pressure. The waking up was easier. Everything okay. was a lot easier. Okay. So it also makes you stop and step back and think, wait a minute, you know, recenter yourself and say this is what I'm here for and if that music supports people I think that's really important you know music can do wonders <laughs>